preseason predictions tended to overlook the squad at Minneapolis, but the Golden Gophers were patiently waiting for the big ones. Illinois, Wisconsin, and Purdue found Coach Wes Fessler with a squad of giant killers who played co-champions Purdue and Wisconsin to a tie, their best season since 1941. Coach Fessler lost 14 lettermen from the squad in 51. Captain of the Gophers this past season was senior guard Dick Anderson, and 1953 captain-elect Paul Geale continued to rewrite Big Ten football records after setting an all-time mark for total yardage in 51. A gifted passer was quarterback Don Swanson. Minnesota's brilliant Paul Geale is one of the most versatile backs in Big Ten history. An All-American on the gridiron and off. Here he breaks over right tackle to pick up 15 yards. This year, Paul Geal tied the existing Big Ten record for the most offensive plays in one game, both rushing and passing. Here, Geal proves why he is always a threat as he goes back to pass, decides to run, and rolls up nine yards for the Gophers. <laughs> Sophomore end Bob McNamara became a favorite target of Geal during the season, and McNamara was picked on the all-Big Ten poll. Here he takes a screen pass from Geal, gets plenty of opposition from the defense, but turns in a neat bit of running down the sideline. And again, on the combination of Giel to McNamara, Giel pitches a perfect strike, and it's good for another Minnesota touchdown. Paul Giel and Bob McNamara will return for the 1953 season, along with a number of other key lettermen. 